Welcome to Prep Your Data. We're a startup company aimed at making it easy to clean up messy data yourself without programming your advanced Excel skills so that you can quickly get on with analyzing your data. This video shows how you can unpivot cross-tab data into a simple list to make the data more compatible with Excel pivot tables and charting using Prep Your Data software. Today I'm working with some data on CO2 emissions that I got from a public website. It has the form of a crosstab with one row per country and one column per year. This is just fine if I want to read it, but if I want to do more processing, especially using charts and pivot tables, there is a problem. Each of the columns for the years comes out as a separate value, so it's hard to get the charts to show trends properly. Before I can get to meaningful data, I need to unpivot the crosstab so that it looks something like this with one year and one value per row and of course many more rows. I just got onto the 2001 data and I'm a tenth of the way through my data set. Now that transformation is possible in Excel but it can be time consuming and error prone. Let's try using Prep Your Data instead. Here we are in Prep Your Data. The initial view shows me the data sets I've worked with plus the ability to import more data from a file or from the clipboard. In this case, the data I need is in a file, so I'll import it. Now, this UI style may be familiar to some of you, but not others. Our UI is based on the Metro UI that is part of Windows 8. This is the advantage that it can be used on a tablet with a finger or on a desktop with a mouse. Having imported my dataset, I click on it to see the columns. Now I'm going to change my view just so that I can see more of the data that I have available. So I have country name, country code, and then a bunch of columns, one per year. And I want to convert that crosstab to a list. Here, a wizard tells me what it's going to do. Yes, it looks like that's what I need to do. I need to convert data that looks like this to data that looks like that. I need to add the columns that I want to convert. In this case I want to add most of them so I'm just going to select all and then remove the two that I don't need and then add all of those and click next. It's going to produce two columns and I get to name them. I'm going to name the column with the values from the column headers as years and I'm going to leave the column with the values from the data rows as values. Click finish. Now I have four columns and if I switch my view back to the data grid I can see that I'm getting what I expected one row for each year for each country. Finally I'm going to save that as a new file and save it as CO2 data fixed. Now I'm back in Excel looking at the new file. The data has been converted to a list style. Now if I chart the data, the year and the value are seen as two separate dimensions and I can get the charts on trends I want much more easily. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to watch our other videos of Prep Your Data solving other common data cleaning problems.